We're here with Miss Mara and the Anus uh, Blackbird. Sorry, moving the camera too much. Uh, we are here in the back of yard three. She's actually grazing on the by the side of Poach's grape site, burial site. Uh, she and the others are relatively close to the barn this morning. Mara just finished with her checkup at the barn. She came up here into the third yard and is grazing on this wonderful vegetation that seems to grow very, uh, very well when you overturn the soil, or turn over the soil, I'm sorry, turn over the soil and uh, all the elephants like coming here to take advantage of this nice vegetation coming up on Poacher's Grave. I always wonder if there's how much of it is the food and how much of it is pocha. Um, you know, because you see each of them here at different times. It's not like they're all here together at the same time. And uh, I just wonder. You never fully know. Of course, all logic says that it's going to be a division between the two. You know, knowing how sensitive they are. And there's got to be something they feel when they're in this area. Aside from the delicious palatability of the food she's eating. Um, there's got to be something more that's always interesting to see. And she's cleaning the dirt off the roots and making it as clean as possible before she places it in her mouth. <laughs> 